हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज़ हरीश वेलकम टू माय वीडियो सीरीज ऑन शेल स्क्रिप्टिंग बिफोर दिस आई अपलोडेड टू वीडियोस बेस्ड ऑन दी बेसिक कमांड्स इन द लिनक्स नाउ इन दिस वीडियो आई विल जस्ट गो फॉर द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ द शेल प्रोग्रामिंग नाउ व्हाट इज शेल नाउ शेल इज अ कलेक्शन ऑफ यूनियस कमांड्स सो दैट इज नथिंग बट द शेल एंड शेल इंटरप्रेट्स द प्रोग्राम इट इल नॉट कंपाइल द प्रोग्राम so like other languages like c c++ java or any other higher languages so it will not compile the program it just interpreted so it means it's kind of the loosely coupled programming now this definition we will see examine so we'll see how it will work as i said it is a collection of command and one thing you everyone knows so on this command prompt at a time only single command can be executed like ls or pwd something so at a time only single command can be executed on this now we will see the bunch of command how we can write in a single file so here this is my folder where i am currently in and i'll just open new file okay uh, first i'll uh, check this create one file like touch basic dot sh so this will create empty file so this file is created empty file again i'll just check the permission for this now see this basic dot sh file is having this kind of permission it means only read write read write and read permission is there so executing permission is not here so i'll explain it afterward what is the meaning of that executing permission now we'll open this basic so this is empty now see to write the shell script in any file so first you need to write this the location of this bin and bash Right. Now see one command that is a special command that is the echo command that is used to display something on the command prompt or output window. So echo, and then this this is not a single quote. So whatever is a numerical line on your keyboard that is one two three four. So first key is this one. So here you just write ls. Second, echo. Now same thing, pwd. Now suppose echo of date. Same. Then echo. Again one more command that will type that is host name. Minus i, right? So these three four commands I have just typed here, and finally we'll see echo successful execution, right? So these four commands I have just combined or clubbed into this one file that is nothing but a uh, basics dot sh, and this will run on the command prompt. so that all these four files will be executed on the command prompt now save it now check it now see oh here to run this the command is basic dot sh so this will not run actually this program because we are not having the executing permission so see this is a permission denied now we need to provide that right to this so permission so ch more plus x basic dot sh it means we are giving that permission so that permission is accepted and we'll check it whether it is given or not now see this one now here this x and this x it means executing permission is there now we can run this using this now see 
first I'll clear this so that I can say now you are see this is the pw first is the basic dot edge it may see this is listing the files and folders from the current location so this basic dot sh command python shell dot sh these are the files listed using this force command the next one is the pwd the current location so this is using this command and this is the date command so this is the date this is the loopback IP address that's, that is using this one and finally ex successful execution. It means we have seen how to club the multiple commands in one file and how that multiple commands can run at a time and that is nothing but the shell. So I think so you understood what is the meaning of shell, how it write, how it compile so only two steps you need to consider here so first is you need to write i'll write here this line ben and bash this is first step then you need to change change mode then write commands then change mode and run it using dot slash file name dot sh so i think you've understood what is mean by shell so this was about definition about the shell so hope so you understood so please like my video, subscribe it, thank you, thank you very much.